A news for Jack's Consumer Alert now for pet owners. The makers of Purina's pet food, Beneful, are under fire this evening from pet owners who claim their dry dog food killed their pet. A class action lawsuit has been filed against Nestle's Purina Pet Care Company, alleging that a cont contaminant commonly found in moldy grain is to blame. Channel 4's Tarek Miner joins us live now from the Lakewood area. Tarek, this dog food is pretty common. Uh, you know, Rob, it's, it's very common. This is it right here, the Purina Beneful dog food. You can buy it at pretty much any grocery store. This one, they sell it at Publix for $6 and some change. This is the dog food that the California man says killed his three dogs. And we spoke to a local woman who says that her dog got sick after eating this dog food. I ran out of the typical food that I give my dog, so went into um, like a CVS and got that Beneful or Purina, whatever it was. Come here, puppy. 24 hours later, Sadie Frederick says her dog Rosie was sick to her stomach and had diarrhea. She says Purina's dry dog food, Beneful, is to blame. It's packaged as something that should be healthy and, you know, fine for an animal, but then it makes them really sick. A class action lawsuit filed by a California dog owner alleges that thousands of dogs have been sickened or died from a dog food contaminant called mycotoxin. Veterinarian Christian Broadhurst says the contaminant is a mold that can be fatal in large quantities. Mycotoxin is a fairly common grain um, contaminant, but it's usually in minuscule amounts. Um, it's even there are versions in peanut butter that um, you know, are their acceptable levels. But if you get, uh, let's say, a contaminated lot of feed um, that's been moldy, it is possible to get high levels of mycotoxin. Perina fired back, issuing this statement today, saying there are no issues with Beneful. Like other pet foods, Beneful is occasionally the subject of social media-driven misinformation, saying the online postings contain false, unsupported, and misleading allegations. The FDA has not issued any warnings about Beneful, nor had they confirmed they are investigating. Broadhurst suggests that local dog owners don't panic. My initial reaction is we need more information um, because certainly dogs die all the time. It's a very sad, tragic event, but just because three dogs were eating the same food doesn't necessarily mean the same food poisoned all three dogs. Now, that lawsuit filed by the man who claims that all three of his dogs have died, he has asked the courts to expand uh, this lawsuit to any other people who, who come forward claiming that, that their dogs are victims. We're live here in Lakewood. I'm Tariq Minor, Channel 4, the local station. Yeah, Tariq, do we know if Beneful has been sued before? You know, Beneful has faced two other lawsuits, but according to the, uh, the court systems, that, that was thrown out by the judge. However, they do have a product. It's called Wagon Train. They did create a $6.5 million uh, fund for pet owners who claim that they were sick from their, their jerky treats. So Purina has been uh, sued before, but Beneful, uh, this product, they have not uh, successfully won. The, the plaintiffs oh. have not, Rob. All right. Thank you, Tarek. Tarek Miner reporting live for us tonight.